Question 25. Two nitrates decompose on heating according to the equation shown. The lead 2 nitrate decomposed form lead oxide, NO2 and O2. Ammonium nitrate decomposed form nitrogen, oxygen and uh, H2O. One mole of each nitrate is heated separately. The gas produced in each reaction is bubbled through the sodium hydroxide. Uh, only the nitrogen dioxide will react with the sodium hydroxide. The oxygen and nitrogen gas it will not. The volume of any gas that does not react with the sodium hydroxide is then collected and measured. Uh, in both cases, uh, the gas that will be collected is oxygen gas, nitrogen gas. So means for the reaction one, oxygen gas will be collected. For the second reaction, nitrogen and oxygen will be collected. Okay, now the question is, which nitrate shows the greater percentage loss in the mass? and produce the greater volume of gas collected. Okay, for the first one, greater percentage loss, uh, it must be because of the gas. Eh? Because the gas will release and it will go away. So the percentage loss is because of the gas. Eh? And the second one is the volume of gas that collected. Uh, is referred to nitrogen and oxygen gas. Okay, so let's uh, discuss about the calculation. Then you uh, will be more more clear on the uh, why answer is A. Yeah? Okay, so for the okay, we will discuss the lead uh, to uh, nitrate decomposition first. Um, for the equations, um, is uh, two moles of these. Uh, uh, this is a balanced equation. Uh, of course, uh, in the questions, it's, uh, it's mentioned one mole. Uh, but eventually, the percentage will be the same. Okay, so uh, the balanced equation is this one. Right, so uh, two moles of these uh, lead uh, two nitrates uh, will produce two moles of uh, these uh, uh, lead two oxide and four moles of uh, NO2, one mole of O2. If it's one mole of uh, lead two nitrate, then uh, all will be halved, right? But it doesn't matter because uh, uh, the percentage it will be the same. Uh, for the percentage uh, loss of mass, uh, we can use the molar mass to do it. Okay, so we just use the the molar mass of the lead two nitrate. Uh, so let's say it's a two times. Uh, uh, 3G 1.2 uh, and this one is uh, 4 times uh, 46 and uh, plus uh, 32 so times 100% okay because uh, the nitrogen gas and oxygen gas uh, is the the mass loss okay so you get 32.6% uh, so now uh, let's discuss on the uh, ammonium nitrate. Okay, ammonium nitrate. Uh, once you balance equations, uh, you get uh, two moles of this nit uh, ammonium nitrate form two moles of nitrogen gas, one mole of oxygen gas, and uh, four moles of H2O. So if it's one mole, means uh, all will be halved. Okay, so let's calculate the percentage uh, uh, loss of mass. Okay, we consider the gas products only. So it's 2 times 28, the molar mass of the nitrogen, plus uh, 32, the molar mass of oxygen, over 2 times 80. So the molar mass of the ammonium nitrate times 100%, uh, so it's 55%. So the greater mass loss is the ammonium nitrate. Right, The greater mass loss, so it's either A or B now. Okay, let's uh, move on to the uh, the gas that uh, be collected. So from here, uh, one mole of the uh, lead two nitrate produce uh, two moles of uh, the NO two, 
and uh, 0 0.5 moles of O2. Uh, but uh, NO2 will not be collected because uh, it's react with N, uh, NaOH. So means uh, it's going to be 0 0.5 moles of oxygen uh, will be collected. Now, so this one we cannot use two, uh, two moles uh, uh, as I told you just now uh, because it's a specific volume. Uh, so we must use one mole now. One mole will produce 0 0.5 mole. 0 0.5 times 24, we get uh, 12 uh, dm cube. Okay, for the ammonium nitrate, uh, one mole of ammonium nitrate will produce one mole of uh, uh, nitrogens and 0 0.5 moles of oxygen. Uh, total moles of gas is uh, 1.5 mole times uh, 24 dm cube is uh, 36 dm cube. So the ammonium nitrates, uh, it will be the one that uh, have greater volume gas collected. So answer is A then. Okay, that's all. Thank you.